The Holy Tales. Hello, children. Welcome to the wonderful world of the Bible. This is a library, and I live in it. On their way here are three cute little bookworms, Tubby, Gumbo, and beautiful Freckles. They love story just like you. Was a lovely song, children. Wow, Holy, you are awake. That's really nice. Yay! Story time! Awesome! Have we ever told you that we are lucky to have you? You don't have to butter me up. I will tell you a story anyway. Let's start with today's story. Gumbo, listen to the story carefully. So after Jesus was put to death on the cross. His body was buried in a tomb not very far away from Golgotha. Jesus had promised to his followers and disciples that he would rise from death after three days. So the priests and the leaders wanted the tomb to be sealed properly and guarded by men so that there was no chance of Jesus' disciples stealing his body. Mary Magdalene and one of her friends were waiting to go and see Jesus' body. They could only go after the Sabbath, so early next morning the two women went to the tomb. When they reached the tomb, they saw that the heavy stone boulder guarding the mouth of the tomb had already been removed. They thought that perhaps someone else had come to see Jesus, but when they stepped inside, they were shocked. Jesus' body had disappeared. The tomb was empty. Suddenly, two angels appeared. Mary and her friend were terrified to see what was happening. The angels told them not to be afraid. They told the women that the Son of God had already risen. Hearing this, Mary and her friend went running to John and Peter. They said, You must come! The Lord has risen! John and Peter did not believe them at first, but they went to the tomb. When they reached, they saw that the body was not there, and the linen they had wrapped Jesus in was folded neatly and kept on the side. Yeah! So Jesus had risen from death! Oh, I am so happy! I love Jesus! He is so cool! <laughs> Yes, Freckles, he is. Now, will you please answer my question? Absolutely. Ask me. I will answer all your questions today. <laughs> well, who did Mary Magdalene and her friend go to after they saw that the tomb was empty? They went to Peter and John. Yes. Very good, Freckles. All right, Holy. We must go now. Or else Freckles won't let you sleep today. She is so happy. Bye, Holy. Bye, Holy. Your story made me so happy.